welcome to my Rue 21 haul. I'm so excited to be doing this haul for you guys because I feel like there's not a lot of fashion or really fa any fashion at all on my channel. It's really geared towards makeup, but this is a beauty channel, so I wanted to start incorporating more stuff on like fashion and hair and home decor. So this is going to be a fashion haul, obviously, so I'm really excited that I can finally incorporate that into my YouTube channel. So before I get started, there's a three things that I wanted to go over. First of all, my eye makeup. I have done a makeup tutorial on, before on this channel, so I will link that makeup tutorial down below. It's a, using the ColourPop Cosmetics eyeshadows. And then the second thing is that I'm going to be putting up videos twice a week, every Sunday and Wednesday. I don't know if you guys have noticed the trend, but that's what I've been doing for the past couple weeks, maybe even a month or two. And um, I just wanted to see how it would work for me, and it's been working out great. So that's pretty much what I'm going to do. I'm going to put videos up on Sunday and Wednesday. Now, I do have the Invisalign series, which I'm going to be sprinkling throughout my um, YouTube channel, but I'm going to be putting those up on Friday. So if I have any sort of update for you guys, it'll be put up on Friday. Now the third item is that I created a new YouTube channel. Yeah, I know I'm early in my career, but I've already created another YouTube channel and I'm so excited about it. It's called Beauty Vlogger 101 and it's a channel that's completely geared towards beauty vloggers and aspiring beauty vloggers. So pretty much it's, you know how they have those um, YouTube videos that beauty gurus do where it's just like how to be a successful YouTuber. It's going to be that but it's the entire channel. So each video will be a specific topic. So my first one, which is going to be up tomorrow, is called Should I Create a YouTube Channel? And then my next one will be What Should My YouTube Channel Name Be? And like pretty much how to figure that out and, you know, music, social media, thumbnails, pick monkey, like you name it. There's going to be videos on there once a week every Thursday where I'm going to be showing you guys, um, pretty much taking you through my journey as a beauty blogger. So yes, I don't have a lot of subscribers right now, not like 10,000 or 50,000 where I can say, this is how to be a successful beauty guru. But it's going to be showing you my experience throughout my journey as a beauty blogger and what I've learned and what I think would be helpful for you guys. And obviously I'll do updates. But if you want to see um, more about uh, why I created this channel and what it's about, please check out my welcome video. I will link it down below as long as along with my channel called Beauty Blogger 101. So I'm super excited about it. So stay tuned for that every Thursday. I would love it for you if you guys could go over there and check it out. Also, if you're not a beauty aspiring beauty vlogger or beauty vlogger, you're more than welcome to go check it out. It could be really interesting for you to watch, but I'm just letting you know that it really is driven towards beauty vloggers. All right, let's jump into the haul. The first items that I'm going to be showing you are the ones that I am currently wearing. So up we up up we up here we have an earring that's from a little packet of earrings I'm going to show you soon. It's just like like 20 studs on one like little um, cardboard thing. But anyway, so I have this like little eagle thing, so I put it up in my upper cartilage. I haven't been wearing um, earrings on uh, like in my cartilage or the rest of my ear, just like really the ones you put down here, because it just takes a long time. Because I actually have, I think like seven holes on my ears. Like I think I, it's like two definitely on each side, one up here, and I think one here. So I have so many. So, but I really wanted to throw this one up there. I thought it'd be fun. Luckily, I could still put it in. And then the other thing that I'm wearing are these earrings, which are also on that same, like, little card of earrings. Um, they had some dangly ones at the bottom, so I thought that would just be fun to tie this all in with this awesome necklace, which I saw. I tried to stop myself from buying so much from there, but for some reason, today was, like, a hit. I can kind of go in there. It's, like, a hit or miss, but um, when I went to shop yesterday, it was such a hit. So I got this necklace. It was $9.99, and then this whole pack... I'll let you guys know later whenever I pull it out, I'll let you know how much the entire pack costs. But this was $9.99, and I'm super, super excited about it. The next item is the top that I'm wearing. So it's just a little tank top, and it's really comfortable and fun and, you know, works really great with this warm weather. And I will stand up and kind of show you more of it. So here is the top. It's really flowy. It has this lace on the bottom. So when you turn to the side, the shirt kind of comes up and kind of dips back down. Now, I don't know if you saw um, what I'm wearing uh, for bottoms today whenever I was showing you my top, but I'm going to show you my bottoms. And this is, if you want to know uh, the truth about beauty gurus, this is it. So this is the truth about beauty vloggers. I am wearing these 4th of July shorts, which are super comfy. Um, so here, I'll just turn around for you guys. But yeah, I think the dress is just white. So it's a little loose on the bottoms, but it's really comfy, and it's not something that I would wear out, so I really don't care. <laughs> it's just super comfy, and I really like it. So that's the truth. Like, every time I'm filming a video for you guys, I'm probably wearing pajama bottoms on my bot, Like, on, uh, yeah, for bottoms or, like, uh, 
sweats or something really comfortable because when you're filming you want to be comfortable you want to be able to do the video without having to be distracted by uncomfortable pants or whatever you could be wearing that I would actually go with this top no I don't actually go out like this now let's jump into this bag so there is a bunch of stuff that I got I wanted to try to get a variety of stuff to show you guys just because I thought this was such a great trip uh, but the first thing that we're going to go over is are these earrings. So I got this like little earring card which has a bunch of studs and then some dangly earrings on the bottom. So here is the other like bird or eagle or whatever it is um, that I have up here. And then I had some dangly earrings down here so I'm currently wearing the ones that are in this space. But it incorporated gold and silver which is really nice because you never know when you're going to want to wear silver or gold. It just depends on the rest of your accessories but this pretty much covers a lot. So I really liked it and I thought it was a good variety. They had a bunch of different um, cards of you know about like 20 studs so you could choose between what you would like. There was one other one that I would kind of wanted to but this one just kind of won me one out. So I just really like this. So we got that out of the way. So the next thing I'm pulling out is this little bandana. So this is like for 4th of July. I thought this would be fun. I'm pretty sure Ray of Sunshine Beauty had this on in one of her photos. I will link her channel down below. But let's, let's try this on. She apparently wrapped it around her head. Ta-da! So this is what it looks like. I'd probably make it look a little bit better if I, you know, it was really going out. But I just kind of want to quickly show you guys. But yeah, I just thought this would be fun for 4th of July. Like something different to wear. I'm pretty sure this is where she got it from. It looks exactly like the one that's in the picture. Um, which I will show a picture above. But yeah, I just thought this would be fun. The next item that I bought are these sandals. I thought that these were really cute and simple. Because right now I had, before I went to uh, Route 21, I only had one pair of flip-flops and they were blue and they didn't really go with much, but I got rid of the ones that I wore out last year because I wore them so much and I don't know, I just go through flip-flops really quickly. But I knew last year even I wanted to have a pair of sandals that were dressy, but not too dressy and that were a little versatile. So if I wanted to go out but I didn't want to wear like these fancy shoes, I could put on something that was nice, but not like my little white flip-flops that are pretty dirty by like after like two times I wear them. Oh, why do I buy white flip-flops? It's I bought well you're gonna see I bought white flip-flops but just because when I wear white shorts I think it looks really nice to wear white flip-flops but I got these just because I thought that they would be nice to wear when I wanted to get a little bit dressier. Then I also got a pair of these flip-flops. I wasn't originally gonna get it because I missed it even though I was looking for this it was on a, another wall that I didn't see but the girl said hey you can go get another pair of sandals for a dollar which I probably should have gone and found something more expensive, but I was in line, so I just like grabbed something, and I knew I wanted white flip flops. So these are two ninety nine on the shelf, but I got them for a dollar because of that deal. So if you buy one pair of sandals, you can get the other one for a dollar. So you know, just your basic flip flops. Next item I am super excited about. It is this Fourth of July top, which honestly, I'm gonna be wearing this, you know, outside of Fourth of July. Like I'm not only gonna be wearing it on Fourth of July, or, like Memorial Day or something. I think it is just so freaking cute it's like really flowy really comfortable and this back are you kidding me i love tops with cute backs like this is just freaking amazing and i think it's really a fashionable top it's not just like you know like a, like a crew neck t like a t-shirt where it's just like you know like a gym t-shirt that just has a flag on it it's like happy fourth of july like this is really fashionable i love this so let's see how much was this this was $9.99 and it was also on sale. So hopefully they still have it there if you guys want to run out and get it. Um, uh, the one top, the top that I'm wearing right now is $9.99 and it was on sale. But hopefully it's still around because this is so freaking cute. So I found another little bag in here. So this has, I think, the ring. Yeah, the ring that I got. Because I finally, there was other times I was going to get those knuckle rings. But I just... I don't know. I didn't because I was like, I don't need it. And then, of course, today, when I whenever I went shopping at Route 21, I was like, okay, this is the time. So I'm going to get a couple more things than I was originally going to get so I can do a haul. So I'm going to get this. So this, I still have the uh, tag on it. So what? It's $2.99. So this is the knuckle ring. I just think it is just so incredibly cute. Um, you know, just simple, but still there's a little something to it. It's not just a plain old ring. So I definitely want to get more of these. So I've been really excited about the stuff that I've already showed you, but I think I'm the most excited about these, not just from like a fashion standpoint, but from a, like how it fits standpoint. So I got a bunch of high-waisted shorts. I've been wanting to get high-waisted shorts for a while, but I'm very particular about them. But these worked so great and they are so comfortable. So they're high-waisted shorts and um, 
they're super comfy, like really, really stretchy. So here, I'll button this up for you. But it has like three buttons on the top. So there's three buttons. And I think it's just on uh, then pockets on the back. And they're just, I think the most thing, it just fit like a glove. And it was so comfortable. So I got a red pair. Because I was getting ones that kind of 4th of July. But I could totally just wear this any other any old time. Like with like a white v-neck or a white tank top or some sort of other shirt. Like, it's not just 4th of July based, but I also got this really fun bright blue, royal blue pair. Um, just think that's just so freaking cute, and they're so comfortable. I love them. Then I wanted to get a white pair of those exact same shorts because they fit so well, but they didn't have it in my size. So I was like, of course. I found the greatest pair of shorts ever, and, you know, they don't have them in white. So, but luckily, you know, I, I'm, I'm going to go back in and see if they have them because it didn't seem like they were, like, like, it's not like on clearance or anything. So I'm hoping that next time I go back in there, they'll have them. But I did want to get a pair of shorts that were a little bit more versatile. Jean pair, a jean pair of high-waisted shorts. So I got these jean high-waisted shorts, which also fit amazingly. Like, I had such a hard time previously trying to buy stuff from Route 21. But I, like, found stuff that really fit like a glove. So on this one, they have just, like, a bunch of buttons going up and down on each side. But, yes, I oh, love these shorts. Now that's it for the haul, but I did want to mention that I got these coupons. So they had like this thing going on where if you spend uh, 40 bucks, I think every 40 bucks you spend, you get a $20 uh, pretty much gift card. So if I go in, how much do I have to spend? If I spend a 40 or more when I go back in, I get $20 off. And then I have two of these, so I can use both at once. And so if I spend $80, I'll get $40 off. So it's half off deal, which is amazing. So whenever I go back to get to my shorts, I'm definitely going to be using these. So let's see, when do they go on? It starts Wednesday, June 24th, and goes until June 28th. So I don't know if they're still giving these out. I don't know if you go within the next couple of days or even the next week, if you can still earn some of these. And then by the time it gets to uh, June 24th, you can use these. So that's just a really great idea to save some money, because if you know you're going to go out and buy stuff, you might as well go somewhere where you can get the clothes that you want and then get a coupon to go back and spend more, but get half off essentially. So you just spend 40 and you get 20 bucks back. So it's really like you're spending 20 bucks. So I'm definitely going to be taking advantage of that. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed my Rue 21 haul. Please let me know down in the comments if there's anything from Rue 21 that you got and loved. Also, if you want to see more videos from me, please make sure to hit subscribe below, like this video if you've liked it, and I will see you all in the next video. Bye! Are, did I film this? Oh my gosh, what if I'm not filming right now? Am I filming? I am. Okay. That would really suck. I hadn't been filming that. Just an idiot talking to the camera. Also, nope. It's going so well. It's going so, so well. I messed it up.